Hello, welcome back to 31 Days of Halloween. Today is day 19 and it's a very special day because five years ago today, I became a certified special effects makeup artist, which is very exciting. Yay! I look like a mess because I am a mess. Yeah, see all that beautiful texture? She didn't used to live here. Today, I am turning myself into a zombie. To do zombies, I use third degree silicone based like modeling. I don't even want to say wax because it's silicone. If you want a very in-depth tutorial on how to use third degree, let me know. I'm more than happy to do that. The important thing to know is that you're going to get A and you're going to get B. And once they mix, they will set quickly. So don't mix them. And you have to have equal portions A and equal portions B for it to work properly and for it to actually dry down. Like if you do more A than you do B, not gonna dry, you won't be able to use it. First thing I'm gonna do is what I always do, block out my eyebrows. On my palette, I have equal parts A, equal parts B, or at least as close to equal as I can make them. And I'm taking the back of a brush and I'm going to mix them together. I'm gonna start with my eyebrows and just build them up. Oh, don't get in my eyelashes, please. I really don't have any rhyme or reason to it. I just start throwing it on my face and adding texture. I just know that I want this like C shape on my face to be the thickest. I'm now just going to powder everything with baby powder just to get rid of that slight stickiness that it might still have. James Charles Morphe palette. It's a little fluffy brush. Mix brown, like dark brown with a touch of black and some purple and throw that right under my eye. Now that that is done, I am taking my Skin Illustrator Zombie Palette for obvious reasons. I'm going to take a pretty flat, big-ish eyeshadow brush and I'm going into the Rice Paper Tone color mixed with the Midnight Brown color. I'll mix red and blue, make purple. Okay, let's see what this does. It's too watery. I did too much alcohol. I'm so sorry. Who is calling me? I am busy. Oh, it's my mommy. Hello, mama. Say hi to YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Nice to see you today. <laughs> this looks really crazy. I am aware. I'm going to put flush over all of this flush tone. I'm Before I do that, though, I'm going in with a little bit of black mixed with some blue on a teenier brush and I'm gonna try to put that into like all of the little divots. All of this purple is primer to give a nice undertone. Okay, I'm gonna add the flesh tone now. Look at who just snapchatted me. Should I respond looking like this, guys? We'll add the details now. This is gonna take a while. Okay, so instead of boy, this looks like Freddy Krueger. I didn't intend to look like Freddy Krueger today, but I somehow made myself look like Freddy Krueger. Instead of boring you by wa making you watch me put dark red blood color in between all of these little divots. I'm just gonna do it off camera and I'll be right back. I'm adding concealer on my lips to block it out. Disgusting. I should mention that to do this, I'm just using the same colors that I used all over my face. I'm gonna start with the lightest color. Whereas before we'd started dark and then when light, I am now starting light and gradually going darker. 
you're welcome for the explanation that no one listened to because you just fast forward on these videos to the end design. <coughs> I should have talked while doing it. Okay guys, I had every intention of this coming out as a zombie and for whatever reason, I look like this came out stupid. Don't even look up there. Um, for whatever reason, I ended up looking like Freddy Krueger. If this was all red and there was like a few more big holes, this would look like Freddy Krueger. This is what we call fail. But uh, if this is at least a good demonstration of the texture that you can get while using third degree. Does that help at all? Does that help you see without bright yellow? I'm not pleased. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, what are you doing? Quit lurking, hit that subscribe button. You know what to do. And uh, yeah, I will see you right here tomorrow for another day of 31 days of Halloween. And hopefully I won't look like a deceased deceased lion why do i look like a lion what went wrong this will be really fun to peel off though if you want to watch me peel this off follow me on tiktok at sb.samanthabrook because like i can already feel it it's gonna be so good it's just gonna go like one of those face masks you know bye this is what happens when i'm left alone everything looks weird mercury's in retrograde man <laughs>